I often get asked, what are the best golf clubs for a beginner or somebody who's not got a big budget? Normally I say, just get yourself some old clubs, second hand clubs from like five years ago and they'll do you. But today, what I'm going to show you is probably the best set of clubs you can buy for your money. And I mean that. Good. I think I've just seen it bounce right there. Ah! Oh! Oh! I've ripped my pants. Here. So what we've got is the Wilson X31s. These are a box set from 2014. So five year old. Let me tell you now, you can buy these still new for about 230 English pounds. But even better, when I say it, they're on eBay now for 40 odd pound. Yes, 40 odd pound, probably $50. Crazy, I know. So I'm going to put these up head to head against my clubs, what are fitted for me. So I've got a driver fitted for me, a Callaway Epic Sub Zero, and I've got Ping Eye Irons. Also, I've got tightless wedges, bulkies. I'll show you all these clubs, the Wilson, shortly. But let's just get a few holes done, head to head. Is there any difference? I'm going to start off, tightless Pro V1X, number one, with loads of pink on. That's going against a tightless wob, uh, number eight, on its own. So if you're new to the channel, this channel has golf mates, it doesn't have subscribers. It's what you see now on the left is golf mates. We don't have subscribers, we're all mates. So what we're going to do, it's a bit daft. If you're new, you, you'll understand this. There's no budget for a cameraman. So I'm going to give him a whack, then I've got to leg it behind and let you see where it's landed. If I hit it straight. So I better hit a good one, otherwise I'm going to look an arsehole. And I've come off that one slightly. I don't need to zoom in because I've sliced the tits off it into the trees, but that's where it's gone. So it's going up against my Epic, all fitted for me. In fact, that was a great start, that. It is early in the morning. It's that early, there's still freebie two on the greens. That's due. Little bit of English slang there. Right, my Callaway Epic. Uh, a bit one, a bit one, a bit one. I don't know if you're going to see it land, am I too quick? It's down there. Yeah, you got it, that. Right, golf mates, what I've got here is this. My Callaway driver went 81 yards further, but better strike and he didn't hit the trees. I've got 205 yard to that pin, but I am going to try and go left of it, try. And I'm going to use the rescue club, which, I won't lie to you, looks fantastic. Coming up now, that's a four iron rescue club what comes with a set. Looks brilliant. Right, I need to pull one out of the bag here because that's a long way down that one. Now this grip feels better. Obviously the bloke who had these didn't use them a lot. In fact it's a golf mate who's given me these clubs so thank you very much. Total forgot your name like everything but I do appreciate it. can't zoom in on that, I can't. No, that was slightly thin. A bit like my hairline. But it's bounced that bunker, what you can see there. An honest Jesus tonight chicken and rice. I bet you that's near the pin or near the green. I've got a sneaky feeling that's going to run. Be a nice par, won't it, with these? Right, so I've got 125 yards. I'm going to have to do the traffic light system like OMP told us. And hopefully stay away from that, but I've got a club that should be a little bit big. Ping eye, pitching wedge. Basically, you will not believe this. If you're new to the channel, I'm a seven handicapper. That shot were ranted, but it's one of it. 
So I've gone in the Lebanese lawn. Bunker. Right, golf mates, it's actually done great that, considering. That one was, it's pin high-ish, but it's in the Lebanese lawn. So I'm going to try a little, it's right to left, I don't know if you're going to pick it up, but I mean, like I said, I'll tell you about these irons shortly after this hole. But I'm going to go with a little German, a little nine. I'm just going to try and do a chip and run. Just near that leaf, if you can see it. Right, golf mates. Pressure's on. That's a great shot. Granted, it were two bad shots, but I'll, it, it proves. Doesn't matter what you hit, you've got to hit a better shot. So this is my clubs. I've got a 60, and I don't know if I put the camera in the right place here, but hopefully you'll see it. It's very tricky, should I say? This is slippery. Fact of the matter, it's out. It was an hard shot, that. Right, I've dropped a clanger. There's no other way of telling you this. I've dropped a boo-boo. Got my putter. I forgot to put the putter in for the Wilson. So I'll have to use this putter. I presume it comes with a putter. If it does, I'll show you a picture of it now. Ish. Right, I'm gonna try and go for the Wilson first, because it's here. This is for a par. Boom. Great chip, easy putt, two shite shots, still got a four. Fantastic drive, I'm in the shizen. So if we're match play, my 1800 pound clubs are one down. Right, golf mates, I interrupt this video because I've just found a random, but he's not a random, he's a golf mate, it's called Joe. Joel. Joe. Joe. <laughs> he's come all the way from Belgium, even though he's got an English accent. <laughs> Joe, I'm doing a video about the best clubs ever for a beginner or anybody who's not got a lot of money. Yep. First impressions of them, I'm not going to say anything. That's all right, that's good enough, I think. Yep. Yeah. How about this rescue? See, I'm useless with the rescue. But... Uh, just the look of it, just the look of it. Looks pretty standard, looks pretty basic, no? Yeah, driver. So Joe's driver is an M4, he's got a ping three wood and his irons a Cobra, See King that? Cobra F8. That is whippy, feels whippy. What, but they like the look of it? What would it look like? Yeah, it looks all right behind the ball, I suppose. So it feels whippy, yeah. right. This box set, you get all the irons, bag, driver, Rescue, putter, for 230 quid. That's not bad, is it? Same price as my well, three wood. The second, <laughs> so for, that would, how much for that? About 200 quid, I think, yeah. Okay, what would that be worth now? About 110? Something like that, yeah. The five-year-old, you can buy them on eBay, price is up now, 40 odd quid. 42 quid, I think. For all of it? All of it, second hand. So You'd it's be still not to, wouldn't you? Yeah, so, <laughs> I'm gonna carry on this, Joel. Do you want a free all match for me after? What's your handicap? 18. Right. He's a big lad as well. He ain't vegan. <laughs> do you want a free all match for me? Yeah, after? let's do it. Why and not? I'll use these box set. Yeah. And still give you the shot where you need it. Yep, spot on. But I've no putter, so I'll have to use my, my own putter. All right, I'll let you have that. Fiver. Spot on. I'll catch you in a bit, Joe. Sound. Right, I better show you the clubs. I'm talking a lot of them and losing sense here. There's the driver. Just looks like any old driver to me. Get you some close-ups going over now. So they come, driver, three wood, four rescue, five iron, down to a sand wedge. I mean, the iron's a bit battered, but it's bang on. Now, they are look a bit chunky. If I had one criticism, it's just the, the grips are very thin. Like, I could do an extra layer of tape. But, I mean, the rescue looks mint. I've just thinned one for a par. You know what I mean? Right, so I'm going to go on another hole now. Hopefully I can zoom in and let's carry on the test. But it'd be nice to have a match with him later on, wouldn't it? With a box set. Right, I've set the camera up as best I can. So if I hit a good one, it's leg it behind the camera and zoom. Going to go with my Callaway Epic first now. We're going to mix it around. So it's we're on. It's 380 yards, but with a pin, it's probably playing 400. 
Oh, levered one. Levered one. Can you see it? Dirt. I think I've just seen it bounce right there. Oh, that got smacked. That absolutely got slapped. Oh, like Mike Tyson, one of the best punches he's ever hit. Oh, pressure's on now. Whew. I went live last night with a glass of wine. I'd better give this a whack, can not I? Pressure on though, that got whacked. Yeah. Probably wrong side for go for the pin, but it got whacked. Oh, it's holding that. I don't think it were a better hit, but it's, uh, it's levered. Can we see it? So that were it's straight, but it weren't a great hit. It's straight. It's definitely not as big as the Epic. Definitely not. Right, interesting. So the Wilson X31 is 38 yards shorter than my Epic. So again, there's a massive difference in, diff uh, in length, but I didn't hit it great. So you might not see it, it's just there, but I've got 175, I'm gonna go with a six iron. Pins right at back. If you go past the pin, you're in the poo-poo. But trust me, I won't go past there. I've been doing that with my irons a bit, that that like a push. It's absolutely banged on, it's pin high, but it's right in the bunker. That'll be some up and down. It's a real test. If you want a professional, you know what I mean? I'm sorry. A professional won't play with them. No wrong with it. I wonder what shaft's in. If anything, it's just a grip, a dead fin. Golf mates, this is for you. Got a card, right, have this, of Sean Fowler, and he put 10 euros in for OMP's fund. Brilliant. Sean, thank you very much. Right, golf mates, I'm gonna hit a German or try. Hopefully it doesn't hit these trees. It shouldn't do. Got 142. Might get these, but hopefully it doesn't get these trees. Fits it nice and smooth. Where are you, monkey? Oh, where is it? Has it gone in the bunker? Where's it gone? Oh, chicken and rice. I was panicking then, it were in the bunker. I thought I hit a good shot. See, I am off seven. Not bad. It's actually pin high club were right, but obviously it just either opened the face or the shafts, I don't know. Right, I've got a tricky one. So I'm gonna do like a nine iron bump and run, because I ain't got no specialist wedges here. But listen, I don't wanna get off topic. How cheap is golf? If you're new to golf or even thinking you, you wanna change your clubs, 40 odd pound or 50 dollars or so for a full set of clubs off eBay. Everything, bag. Crazy. Golf is for everyone and this proves it. This is a tricky shot, this. It's all about the magic hands. Not bad. Do you know what? Golf mates, as a seven handicapper, I will take that all day. It's a chance, isn't it? It's a chance of an up and down. Right, I've got this for a birdie. We'll take a par. This is a tricky hole. Not bad that at all, not bad. Don't want to stand in my plain pawnings lie. Right, can I scramble a par? I don't know if I'm all in. I think I'm all in. Just. Come on. Oh, it ran over, hit it. Both bogeys. Sorry, both one over after two holes. Told you. It's the dart thrower. Not the darts. Right, this is a great test. This is the 15th here at Charlton Comardy. Gonna rate two five irons. Just curiosity, it's 315 yards, 325 to the pin. Gonna go the old Wilson first, the box set. Love it, little draw. That, that was like a little Tiger Wood stinger, that, that would mint that. There's no point in me jibbing, jibbing back for zoom in, you should see that, but the sun's right in the old minces.
Now that's two same shots here by the ping. Didn't have any draw on it. It was like a low stinger, a belter. Do you know what? I'm actually really pleased with them. I tell you what, I don't know what it's like with the picture, but the sun's in the minters. 145, 143, two yards in it. But that was a, probably a better strike, the Wilson. Had a little bit of draw, so it would have stopped in the fringe or the rough. And that's ran a bit. So the irons hit proper. I don't think you won't know. Right, I'm going to hit a little late. I'm going to try and swing easy because that pin is a... Uh, it's a sucker pin, it's nasty. Oh, Better do it, it's all over it. Oh, I can't see a thing. Absolutely no idea. Right, golf mates, I've gone to a nine here, all because I think it might be a bit of a flyer. So it's the old, the old German. The other one, I can't see. I can't see the green. It's in the shade and the sun in the old mincers. And I thin the tits off it. My back's not hurting, I just thin the tits off it. I don't know if it's the sun in the face or what. What I do know, I've seen it bounce near the pin. I'll try and zoom in, see if we can see it, but I doubt it. But it's worth a go. If you never go, it's like a lot lottery ticket. If you don't buy it, you never have a go. I don't know if you can see anything there. Keeping this live, 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 live. Bird holes, whatever. I don't know what it is. Here, let me see them. In birds pecking for bloody worms, but look, pitch mark. That's from that's for my ping, but look. Pitch mark for the Wilsons about 150 yards up the fairway. Two birdie putts. Did not see this coming. Or a birdie for the few the new kids on the block. Ah! Oh! Oh! I've ripped my pants. Here. Must be put it on timber. I can't believe I've ripped my pants. Right, okay. We'll go for this one. I have as well. What if you see it this way? Right, focus. Right, so I've ripped my pants, I've played with some golf clubs that cost 40 odd pounds or 50 dollars. Driver maybe know the difference, maybe. Irons, there's a lot from Belgium who we met earlier on, I'm going to go and see if I can dick him, but it depends if you can see my arse or not, I don't want my arse hanging out on these videos. Listen, if you enjoy the video, press like and don't forget, be a golf mate. And, split my pants.